Okay. Getting everything started, everything going. So y'all bear with me just a second. Shared into the group. So, whenever you guys see that little doodad flashing in the top left corner, that means I'm live. If it's not there, it means that I'm no longer live. Hey, Carrie. So, I have a lot of cups that I've got to work on because I am, uh, I've got a little shelf at this local market called The Market by Southern Grace, and I need to prep stock because have no stock. <laughs> so I have a lot of stuff to work on. Um, I'm going to be doing a wood grain. I'm going to be doing more double-sided tapes. I'm actually going to be using the colors from the January box that just shipped out today. So I'm going to do those. I'm going to do another of those Valentine's Day tumblers that Miss Carrie ordered. Which girl, yours is all sealed. So now I just have to get the flood coat on it, decal it, and final coat. I'm really excited about that. So, whoever hops in, say hey, let me know you're here. And I'm just going to get started working. And, of course, I'm going to be using all CDTC colors tonight. And we're going in with our double-sided tape to do our Mardi Gras cups. And like I said, I'm going to be using the colors from the January box that shipped out today, so you guys are going to get to see those in action. Hey, Haley. Hey, Lisa. And I'm really excited for you. Hey, Danny. I'm really excited for you guys to see these in action because it'll give you an idea of what to create with it. Hey, Rachel. Before you actually get them. So I'm doing a 30 ounce skinny and I think this one is a 25 ounce straight. And we're gonna do the traditional purple, green, and gold that everyone so often sees with Mardi Gras. And I know that a lot of you have placed a lot of orders with the sale that is still going on, by the way. We still have the 50% off sale going on. Uh, use code HALF OFF, all caps. If somebody could type that code in the comments for me, I'd really, really appreciate it. Um, so, if anybody can tell me, and it's got to be the first person to do it, what the purple, green, and gold stand for with Mardi Gras, Mommy. you guys will get a freebie from me in your, uh, your shipment from your order. So who can tell me what the purple, green, and gold stand for with Mardi Gras? Mama. Remember to stagger. Mama. What up? I want to say hi. They can see you. Say hi. Hi. Remember to stagger your seams with your double sided tape just like with your washi and I'm only doing one size on these Thea Eileen you being a monkey go play I can't okay. 
Yes, Margo, yes. Thank you, ma'am. In your order, you will get a freebie from me for answering that. Margo was the first one to place the answer, guys. So, congratulations, Margo. And yes, it is justice, faith, and power. So, let's do another one. Let's do another one. Just to make it fun, who can tell me where Mardi Gras originated? Bet you some of y'all would be really surprised at the answer. First person to tell me where Mardi Gras originated will also get a freebie from me. That's right, Brandy. Mobile, Alabama, girlfriend. That is where Mardi Gras originated. So, Brandy, you get a freebie from me in your order as well. I think we might do some trivia throughout this live because I'll probably be live for a while. I've got a lot of shit to do. Nope, not France and not New Orleans, you guys. Mardi Gras started right there in Mobile, Alabama. And so... The questions tonight could be centered around Mardi Gras. They could be centered around uh, past boxes. They could be centered around the names of our glitters. They could be centered around something that I said three or four months ago. Depends on how much attention you were paying during those lives. I feel like the dude from Saw. Let's play a game. <laughs> the only difference is you're not fighting for your life. And I'm being careful to make sure that my double-sided tape does not hit my paint. Because, again, today, like the other day, I was a jackass and painted just a couple of hours ago. And it pulled up some of my paint in the areas where it wasn't stuck stuck, if that makes sense. Oh, look, you guys, my birthday hey. boy right here, the big 14 today, my firstborn and my only son. And he's just completely indifferent right now. Teenagers. What? Or as my friend Tammy likes to call them, teen assers. I see you. I said it. I gave birth to you. I can say it all I want to. I'm gonna come take a bath. Okay. Hey, Mama. Hey, what up? I got a question. I might have an answer. One day, you sure do you want to try eating one of the new, like you and um, the group have to go with? Wait, what? Josh should, um, okay. So, I said the first um, thing wrong. Daddy. 
Mm -hmm. should make a cup, but it has to be one color Daddy. challenge. Daddy. Just a one color challenge? Yep. You know, that's not a bad idea. Because solid colored cups aren't... You know, I did, they can be... They can be challenging, but solid colored cups are also a great challenge for brand new beginners. So that is not a bad idea, kiddo. Oh, yeah, that's what I Margo, the five years. Where has the 14 years gone? Oh, my God. Like, I, I've been in my feelings all freaking day. So... That's and where I'm at. The reason why I said that so you can show the new beginners how to make a one color cup. That's a good idea, girlfriend. Ava the smart. <laughs> yes, Ava's smart. So when you're doing just one solid size for your double-sided tape it makes it quite a bit easier to actually get it done quickly because you're not going back and forth you know popping on different sizes and all of that good stuff and so the uh Oh shit, Brandy! Mommy, look, I'm floating. Mama, look, I'm floating. Girl, what? I don't know what do you need. You need everything. You need to go through what you have, <laughs> see Mommy. what you don't have of ours, Mommy. and then get it. Look, I'm floating. Put down, Benny. Mama, Mama. I know why I slept in for like five minutes. Why? Because you know how I leave at 7.20? Uh-huh. So I like sleeping in for a couple more minutes. That's what I do. I was thinking that the other day, Sailor 8 in November. And I was wondering where the time goes and how she's been here eight years already. It makes me sad. So, I have a 14-year-old, and he's my only boy. And then my daughters, Lessie is going to be 13 in May. Ava just made nine last month, and Thea just made four in November. And they they tell you that the first year goes by the fastest as a mama. But what they don't tell you is that it doesn't slow down any after. Hi, mama. And then one day, your sweet little boy is taller than you are with a voice deeper than his daddy's. And it blows you away. <laughs> it absolutely blows you away. Hey, Mama. What a... Did you notice after I turned nine, I noticed that it will be my last digit birthday. Yes, your last single digit birthday. So, I'm going to tape these two cups and then glitter them. And then we're going to do a wood grain, and then I'm going to do the other Valentine's cup that I want to do. I was at Walmart today, and I picked up some more washi tape, like different washi tapes, that I'll show y'all uh, whenever we get to that point. So I can play a little bit more with the colors for that cup because we have other washies. I'm excited about it. Like, I think I'm addicted to adding washi tape to cups now. <laughs> oh, 
but I'm almost done taping this one already. So is anybody uh is anybody working on stuff tonight while they're watching or is everybody just hanging out? Like what's everyone doing? Brandy, I know normally whenever you watch, you're working on stuff. Can the wood grain be made into crackled? Not necessarily on your cups, but on any. Like, the wood grain area be what's crackled? I mean, I've never done it, so I'm not sure. Danny, no! That's awful. I'm so sorry, girlfriend. Hey, I remember Danny tested positive for COVID today. Oh, that sucks. It does. Really does. Mermaid peekaboo, smoke effect, pink camo peekaboo, wood grain, some pigment ones, and a tangram. Brandy, get it, girl. You are always so freaking busy. You know, Carrie, that, honestly, I think that might be a question that you should ask, like, to the group in general, because I have still yet to do a Crackle Cup. Oh, I'd, maybe, Brandy, do you think you could answer that one? She's wanting to know if you can crackle a wood grain. Like, so that the wood grain spot is what's crackling, <laughs> if that makes sense. No, I'm telling y'all, I wish this damn crap would just go away. So she's wanting to know, okay, so you have your, like, glittered base, and then you do your crackle on top. She's wanting to know if that crackle could be wood-grained. All right, so we got one tape. One cup taped up, so we're going to hurry up and do the next one.
maybe maybe whenever you're doing that just concentrate on the areas that you're doing the wood grain on so that the crackle so that the uh, the ink doesn't get on the area that you have exposed through the crackle if that makes sense I mean, I, I don't see why it wouldn't be the same concept as a peekaboo. You're just not peeling anything up. Yeah, that's that's what I'm thinking too, Brandy. Dip the brush instead of putting the ink directly on the tumbler. That's what I was trying to convey. I can't wait to see how it comes out, Carrie. So my thinking with my double-sided tape for the Mardi Gras tumblers here is that like one of the common shirts that you see around Mardi Gras time is your color blocked purple, green, and gold shirts. And they're striped. They're stripy. So I want to like I, that's essentially what these stripes with the double sided tape are going to be is those color blocked stripes Definitely post the end result tomorrow. I think that's going to look awesome. And it would look really good with sunflowers, Margo. That's a great idea. I think I might turn my, uh, my wood grain into a shipwreck tumbler. I haven't done one of those in a really long time. Alright, this one's almost done. And so, by the way, Thanks to you Amaze Balls members. Karis has completely sold out on the site, which is the light pink that was used in the pretty pencil bundle and in the live that I did the other night with the Valentine's Cup. I'm so excited for you guys to get your January boxes. 
you guys are gonna have all five of the glitters that were in there. You're gonna have a mask that you can decorate. You're gonna have, I gotta pull it out, a heart trinket box mold. So this is what the mold looks like. Not heart, listen to me, crown, good lord. You guys are gonna get one of those crowns that you can fix to the top of your tumbler. And you're gonna get a 20 ounce skinny straight. And then there will be multiple different lives using the glitters with multiple different techniques. Oh no, what is the pink that she got in her bundle? I have to start tomorrow shipping out all the stuff that uh that was ordered last night and today with the sale. And I've got 25 colors already that I need to restock. So they're moving fast. So I think the only thing that I'm dreading with packing up everything is having to measure out those micas because we don't have those pre-packaged. And they get everywhere. <laughs> Glitter flow would look really good with January colors or even a Milky Way because you can kind of make it look like the top of a king cake. That's kind of what I'm thinking for one of my box lives with the January colors since I'm already doing the double sided tape right now. What are you doing? Yes, girl. Brandy, wait a minute. Hold up. Finally got some Hebe. You haven't had Hebe or did you run out of Hebe? I could have swore I sent you some. I love doing a Milky Way. I am a sucker for a Milky Way because to me, I find them super easy. There's that one and I think this one might fit as the very bottom line. Yes, it does. especially in this business, but with all businesses, 
but especially one where you're you're crafting for a living, we are our own worst critics. Like it's it's horrible. We really are. We down the stuff that we make on a regular basis when just because we don't like it doesn't mean that somebody else isn't going to love it. Let me get a piece of paper. Okay. So, I'm going to start with the 30. And we're going to go purple, green, gold, purple, green, gold, so on and so forth. And our January colors are holographic. We have Seleno. Tegetti and Electra for our purple, green, and gold. So those are three of the five colors that you will receive in your January box. Um, my double-sided tape, uh, I got one from, Am like, one roll, one package of it from Amazon and one package of it from the NOLAs. Um... And it's just multi-packs of the double-sided tape. Hey, Casey! So, I'm going to go ahead and start pulling all of the ones that are going to have my purple. And I think I might go ahead and simultaneously do both of these. That way, I'm pouring the colors out once. And I really think that this is the only thing that I dislike about double-sided tape. But I was about to pull the whole wrong one. Is making sure that when you're starting to pull the backing that you're not pulling your tape with it. And, of course, you want to make sure that you count so that you don't pull the wrong piece of tape. And if your stuff looks like it has like a little bubble or air bubble, you can take the back of whatever you're weeding your tape off with and just smush it down. That way you're not putting your fingers directly on it like I did a couple of minutes ago. Odin, get down. Sitting there trying to get something off the top of the entertainment center. His birthday is tomorrow. And Mardi Gras is a pretty big thing here in Morgan City for us. We, uh, we have quite a few local crews and our own parades in our area. And the last. 
last one. So here's a little piece of CDTC trivia for you guys to dig up. And the first person to answer correctly will also get a freebie from me. Could be a mold, could be a sample, could be a glitter. Go back to CDTC's very first box whenever we started sourcing our own glitter. Those of you that got it that are watching, that would be the February box from last year. What was the theme of that box and what colors did we send out? February box last year and if you remember that's whenever we had the COVID fiasco start in China because all of the shipping was super late what was the theme of CDTC's very first box once we started sourcing our own glitter and our own colors and what were those colors? wonder if anyone's going to be able to answer that. I wonder how many people are running and looking. <laughs> because that one's definitely going to be hard to find. Last piece of tape for our purple. Cody would know. Cody would know what the first box is. She's tending to a sick hubby right now. start laying some glitter. So we're going in with Celano. Yes, these are going to be Mardi Gras cups, Jordan. These are our colors from our January box. Yeah, you should. 
I think you've been following since the very beginning, though, Margo. And so I'm just putting this glitter all over the exposed tape. And then I'm going to do just like I did on the live the other night. And I'm going to like rub it into the tape. The name of this purple is Seleno, C-E-L-A-E-N-O. I actually think that this one is out of stock on this site as well. I said I've got a lot of colors that I have to restock. So, tonight I am actually utilizing a lot of different stuff. I've got a lot of stuff to work on the end. Um, right now I am using the January box colors. I'm going to dump them both. Well, I'm going to glitter them both first and then push in. I'm working on some Mardi Gras cups, so I thought what better way to show off the colors from the Mardi Gras box than to do it on Mardi Gras cups. The box is just shipped out today. Yes, Margo, all of the January boxes are sold. The January boxes, and I'm going to be perfectly honest with everybody, our January boxes did not do as well as other months normally do, and I not, I'm chalking it up to those boxes being on sale during the Christmas holiday in the middle of a pandemic. So I'm, I'm really hoping that the February boxes gain speed. And that they do better for us than our January ones did. That was March, Margo. Close, but that was March. We're looking for the February box. Very, very close, though. Kaylani, Aura, and Eos. So you had one of the colors. Right. Calypso was in the February box. <coughs> So, what could have had you guys tripped up with that one is because of COVID locking down China, as long as it did, we didn't get our shipment for both sets of products until it was time to ship the March box out. So, everybody that had ordered a February and a March box, that was a double shipment, if that makes sense. <coughs> Alright, I'm 
going to go ahead and put all of this back into my baggie. Y'all, look at it on my hand, how pretty that is. And I'm just going to push it into my tape to make sure it's really good and stuff. Yes, Rachel. Yes. Calypso, Narissa, and Isla. But what was the theme of that box? Yes, mermaid theme. So you will get something from me in your next shipment. That was our very first box for when CDT Crafts actually got its name and, you know, our, our identity was born. Rachel, you used to order two of them all the time, girl. Rachel, I believe, has been with us since the very beginning. From before I even started sourcing my own glitter. And I thank you for being here with us as long as you have. Everybody, really, that's been with us as long as they have because... Let me tell you, CDTC would not have survived nearly as long as it did without y'all's patronage. And, you know, I, with us being as small of a business as we are, y'all are, you know, y'all are helping me take care of my family. So, that means the absolute world to me. Nope, one other supplier, not two. We, when we first uh, started doing CDTC uh, without Muggle Magic, because that's who we were using before, um, we were, we weren't going to start stocking colors. No, the shell mold was in the beach box. That was me. So, but anyway, we, uh, when we ventured out on our own with Mrs. Nola's blessing, because before I started doing anything, living as close to that area as I do, and being as big of a fan of the Nolas as I am, I wasn't stepping on Glitter Royalty's toes. I went and talked to Mrs. Nola herself first. And we, uh, at first we were basing our colors Thank you, Leanne. Thank you. But no, when we started, we were basing our colors off of stuff that they carry on the site. That way, whenever y'all ran out of what we sent, y'all had something to compare it to with them so that you guys could go and reorder. Because at first, the intention wasn't to restock colors or to carry any colors, but... You know, I, uh, 
I had the encouragement of Mrs. Nola to do my own thing. And if it wouldn't have been for her giving me that encouragement, I really don't think that CDTC would have gone very much further because I, mean, I was lost, you know? So, Rachel Donald, you guys, I mean, as if y'all didn't already know this, that woman is a true angel. She's amazing. And I want to make sure that I have the excess off of the tape. That way I don't contaminate the, uh, the double-sided tape whenever I go to pull. Oh, I see the difference now. I remember ALMM and MNG, but not the rolls. Yes. Oh, thank you so much, Jordan. Thank you, guys. I, I, I love that y'all love the boxes, and I love each and every one of you. The new ones that come to me from recommendation or from finding the group on accident. And everybody that's stuck with me since the beginning. Like, y'all are what makes CDTC possible. So, thank y'all. It takes us a little while to grow, but we get in there, guys. And yes, Rachel is awesome. That woman right there, I'm telling you, she's a legend. She is an absolute peach. She's got an amazing eye for glitter, quite obviously. She has got a heart of freaking gold. So if I could actually get my shit together, Margo, this cup sitting behind me here is the Milky Way that I was working on for Cody. So if I could actually get to where I want to tonight, then I can show you guys the Milky Way part of that. Because I do mine in my flood coat. So back to weeding my tape out. I love doing a Milky Way, you guys. There's something just so satisfying about slinging pigmented and mica epoxy. <laughs> These are getting down, it looks like. Yes, absolutely, Margo. You let me know next time you come down here, girl, and we are going to set up a lunch date. That would be amazing. Like, all of my local people, I mean, they get to come and, you know, pick up their orders directly from me. And most of them that are local know me on a personal basis. But I would love to get to know more of my group members. Hey, Randy. Like, Rachel and I have this, uh, Rachel Hood, that is, 
she and I have this running joke that somehow we're secretly related because her maiden name is Crane and my biological father's family like I that's that's the family name before my uh, my stepdad adopted me and my two younger sisters my my uh, my last name was Crane so we have this running joke that uh that we're kin somehow <laughs> You let me know, girlfriend, and we will get together. Let me make sure that my stuff is down on here. Especially down here at the bottom edge. I don't know what my kid is watching back there, y'all. Yes, we are, girlfriend. Yes. Yes, Ken Folk. <laughs> I'm telling you, watch. Somewhere, somewhere down the family tree, it's got to be there, Rachel. It's got to be there. Y'all, I cannot wait to get this green on here and see how this is looking. Like, uh, I haven't played with Tegetti yet. Which is our green for the January box. But I absolutely love it. It is a stunning holographic green. Let her move you. Odin's being a turd, y'all. Just get up and move, Thea. Oh, Shad, tell Finley I said thank you. Miss Emily tries, y'all. Miss Emily tries. My cups don't always come out perfect. Every once in a while, I've got a turd that I'm like, what the fuck did I just make? Pardon my language. Who are you calling? Huh? Yes, indeed, Thea. She's figured out how to video call people on Facebook, you guys. And it's like a monster has been created. You a Thea monster? Yeah. Yep. She is hanging up on you. Leave her alone, Thea. Hey, Chris. Y'all, Chris was a lifesaver today. She came and she helped. Like, she was just coming to pick up boxes. Because she does local pickup. And she helped me get y'all stuff together so y'all give it up for Miss Chris Trahan cause let me tell you my friend came in clutch today alright shake that off and we going in with Tegetti Guys, look at that! Oh, Margo, I wish I could squish him. That's so sweet. My godson, Bentley, whenever we have him over at the house, if I have a new cup up on the table, he'll go, Nanny, that's pretty. And it's the sweetest thing. And then he'll repeat it. That's pretty, Nanny. That's so pretty, Nanny. It's my little boosy badass right there, y'all. He's such a turd sometimes. Yeah, Mom, because he brought me in the head. I mean, the candy. Yes, I'm telling you, y'all, I mean, babies are so sweet. 
like that age, four or five years old, they're just, like, they're conversating really, really good. I was not that much of a hot mess today, Chris. <laughs> Y'all, Tegetti is so pretty. I can't wait for you guys to open it up. <laughs> and if y'all still have your double-sided tape, whoops, you want to get those for mommy? Yes. If y'all still have your double-sided tape from the October box, y'all can easily, yeah. very easily recreate this. There wasn't another one that fell? Yes, I think there was. Where is it? I don't know. Could you look under the couch? I can't. Well, where the hell did it go? Well, I know. Shoot. Yeah. Aha. Look, it was under my pants leg. Yes, that is a dinosaur green, Finley. It kind of does, doesn't it, Chris? I'm knocking shit over all over the place tonight, guys. This one. We'll Y'all, I'm getting really, really good coverage with this particular cut, you guys. And I think I did once at a like uh, a point fifteen hex. Um, this is the, hold on, I'll tell you, Thea, there you go, you're not going to sit behind me and watch that though, hang on one second and I'll tell you exactly what size tape this is, it is, Thea, Uncle Bear said hey, hey. Is he in life? Is he in life? This is half inch, Chris. Is he in life? No, he's not on the live. He's uh he's watching the live and he said hey. How he saw me. Because he could see you on the camera. Like on that camera? Yeah. The one on your desk? Yeah. All right. And I think the tape that I sent you guys in the October box was half inch tape. See, why are you sitting behind me? Why are you sitting behind me? I love it. <laughs> Why don't you go sit behind Daddy? Oh, heck no. That's a monkey on your back. I'm working. Oh, well. Help. Oh, shit. 
Come on, monkey. Y'all, I keep. Oh, I need to glitter this bottom one because I keep hitting it on the paper. All right. Push it in. I definitely will, Chris. Absolutely, girl. Access. And we're going to go ahead, brush one more time. And it's okay to brush over the glitter because if it looks like you've got a pile up, of your green on your purple you can kind of just dust it off yeah girl these are going to be for the store I am so excited about my little shelf over there Oh no, Sandra, you have it? I love playing with double-sided tape. All right. I'm just gonna get a fresh sheet of paper, y'all. Cat said, who that? Who there? All right, pulling my last bit of tape. I'm doing all of these to add stock onto this shelf that I have a, a I rented a space at this local market and I need to build up stock 
Girl, I found these pants at Walmart. I call them my Carol Baskin pants. <laughs> they are literally the most comfortable thing on the face of the planet. Yes, Thea, let her help you. Yes, 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 yes. All right, this tape is ready. It is for Christmas with cheetah print. So I, I'm a sucker for animal print. Like my absolute favorite print is zebra print, but I love cheetah print too. Like I just picked these sunglasses up today and you can see the prints on them. She's coming, Thea. Girl, I got them things for 10 bucks at Walmart. So some people will use their X-Acto knife to peel up the outer layer on their double-sided tape. I just use a weeding tool. I find it easy. Good night, baby. Making sure that I have no air bubbles under my tape. And you really need to make sure that you do that whenever you're doing this on a regular skinny that doesn't have a skinny straight because 30 ounce skinnies and 20 ounce skinnies have a taper towards the bottom. dust this again. This was supposed to be clean paper. And we're going to go in with Electra, which is our golden yellow 
holographic. Well, our kids went back on Monday, so I feel that. You do what you got to do, girl. Trying to be a little less messy with this color. But I don't think it's going to work that way. <laughs> and you see it's only 920 down here we're an hour behind but you know that And there you have it with these colors. You have a very, very traditional looking Mardi Gras tumbler. Hey, Jolene. Margo, that's when you tell TJ that he was enjoying watching the crazy lady with the pretty glitter. Y'all, I am in love with this. Check that out, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead, lay my gold glitter down. I'm not going to brush off the excess until after I have glittered and laid down on each that way I'm not contaminating what I have down here Y'all, somebody tag Erica and tell her that Thea is in the background talking about her future husband. And she's in the back. Oh my God, that was my mom. Oh, I'm going to have to make him a special cup and send it to him. You need to message me and tell me what he's into. I have some kid sized cups sitting in my uh, in my stock room and I would love to make him one and send it to him.
and then I'm gonna spray seal these with triple thick to uh to seal them off and then because they aren't light light colors I'll be able to fast set these and they'll be done and ready for personalization for whomever chooses to pick them up I may throw a decal on them beforehand or I may not what do you guys think decal or no well I will be happy to do that Margo was looking for right there on the floor it's about right so we're brushing off our excess and the beautiful beautiful thing about double-sided tape is how clean your lines come out I will, sugar bear, I will. Like a PJ mask one? Thank you, James. I think it looks pretty freaking awesome myself. Mommy, I'm what making a necklace for me so I can get married. Oh, you're making a necklace so you can get married? Yeah, but I was thinking about my husband. But oh, a Mardi Gras mask one. Okay, that, girl. Mommy, why you say about my husband? Uh, I said that you was back there talking about your future husband. Well, I'm making Give a necklace a so I can get married. What, babe? Give us a sign. Oh, he's playing a game with the VR. Y'all, that is the quintessential Mardi Gras cup right there. I'll probably put like Les Elements en Roule on one, which down here is Let the Good Times Roll. It's French for Let the Good Times Roll. And then throw me something missed on the other one. You know, I'm not sure. I haven't done the double sided tape on a modern curve. So that is a good question. However, Something that you could do so that you could avoid the hassle of curving the tape onto a curve. Um, you could tape off the areas that you know are gonna that where the tape is gonna lay flat, and then the middle area in between. What baby? Can you put this on me? Yes. Like the negative space in between that, that doesn't have the tape on it, you could go in with like Mod Podge and paint your area in with the, uh, with the Mod Podge and your glitter. And that would work amazingly. All right, there's our 30 ounce. You can see the colors better whenever I'm back here. Like up here, they're kind of muted. I come all the way back and you get a really good shot of it. Look at the freaking sparkle on this thing, you guys. So for those of you that got the January box, this is what you're looking at, y'all. That's where it's at. So I'm gonna move these to the side.
depending on how late I'm up, they'll either get sealed and fast set tonight, or they'll get sealed tonight and then fast set tomorrow. I'm trying to knock the excess off, and I'm going to go ahead and suck it up with my little bitty vacuum. your glitter in that area if you know what color you're going to go with right there and then and then pull your tape and do those areas after that dries like I don't really think that the that the particular order would matter with that too much but oh good night good night family Shanty Bay. So, anyway, yeah, I, you could go in with the Mod Podge and do all of that. And I really think that that would work to get around that curve. I want to go ahead and vacuum just a little bit more here. Next, we're doing another Love Day cup. Grab a wipe and wipe Mardi Gras colors off my hands and wipe my little area here real quick. You tell that sweet baby I love him too. Shy man. Hold on, y'all. I got to respond to Erica. She just messaged me. She's not even in the live. Hang on. I'm live. Right now. And Thea was talking about her future husband and making a necklace. For when she gets married. She messaged me. She said, I told Colton he made my heart happy. He said, Thea makes my heart happy too. Shut my baby. Y'all, these kids nowadays, they kill me. They say some of the cutest stuff. Okay, so next we are going to do another cup like we did the Valentine's cup, but I was at Walmart today and I was able to pick up some more washi tape. They had three different kinds, so I was able to get this pack. this pack and this pack so I've got some other washies to play with with this so I'm really gonna enjoy it so I'm gonna go in and start my tape
You lay it on the couch with the boys, Daddy. Sweet girl. So everybody that's still hanging out, tell me, hey, let me know you're here. And so I'm going to do the same thing that I did last night with the multiple different sizes. And they don't have to be the exact same uh, sizing pattern. Because... For me, I love the beauty that no two cups are the same. Like, that makes it fun for me. And then these aren't going to be exactly the same because I have the new washi tapes that I picked up from Walmart today. I really want to go to Hobby Lobby and get some more. And then Amazon has some really awesome ones, too. Hey, Lisa. Lisa, Lisa, still here. But you know what though if you really think about it doing these tumblers for some of us actually does become a job you know I and mean, you're you're selling your wares you know I mean people take orders and all of that good stuff you know they want you to make something custom so this is kind of like a job and it takes money to make money But I personally love the idea of different washi tapes. I don't know why I'm just now getting to the point where stuff like that to me is really cool. Like you would think that that would be something that my, my almost 13 year old daughter would be into and not her mama, but there you go. Another thing I really, really like about double-sided tape is if you have an oops, you can literally cover over it. I think I'm going to go with some brighter pinks tonight. And now we're going to washi. So which washi do I want to do? Like I like how these are kind of darker. We have we have the half inch double sided tape on the site, Haley. Like I obviously we don't have all the sizes. I'll be working on that soon. But we do have the half inch. So I'm going to start with this like coppery foil with the polka dots. It's not quite the same. The, uh, the one that's on the other tape is gold foil with the polka dots. And of course I am still staggering my seams. Oh, 
Yes, you are so right, Leanne. Like, it's, it's versatile. It really, really is versatile. And then it's easy to pull off, so literally one little score with your X-Acto knife, and then you're good. So I think I'm going to do another thin. button it right up against that washi tape. my baby. You could take Dunk and go lay down. Yeah, you can't be stealing my bandwidth, fool. I love it. She asks him, you want some snuggles? <laughs> She's so stinking sweet, y'all. She's being so sweet to him right now. She was kicking his ass last night. And I was laughing so freaking hard I was crying. You hear Lessie giggling back there, babe? So, these three little ones were together, and it makes a really cool pattern. So, I'm going to do three of these little ones as far as the washi goes. This came from another set that I have. It wasn't in this new set that I got today. It's like hearts and then polka dots and then clouds or, yeah, clouds. I just have to find my seam so I can pull my washi. There it is.
get my little clouds. Those of you that have stuck with me so far this evening, thank you because I know that I get long winded. But being on here, being on here with you guys, really motivates me. Helps me get my work done. Oh, I just got a message from Margo that Finley said, please, Miss Emily, make me a sea animal cup. So I'm telling her to tell him, you got it, dude. That did my heart so much good, y'all. I love when little kids watch stuff like this and they get excited about it. Because to me, that's them getting excited about more than, more than just somebody opening up toys on a video. No. Set those over there. Now I'm going to go in with big one Because I'm your mama. But how you know I love eating cookies? Because I know. I know too. <laughs> I know these things. Me too. You too? Yeah, they are chocolate. They are chocolate. Chick. Chocolate. Chip. Chocolate. Chick. Cookies. Yes, they are. Whoa. What are you doing, silly bum? Trying to silly you? Trying to sit with me? No, Mama's working. Uh -huh. Ooh, they got this really pretty one that's got some roses on it that I think I'm gonna, uh -huh. I'm gonna pop in there. Hi, Mama. Hi, Donka. <laughs> okay, whose name is it? I don't know, you tell me. Bobby. Chris. No. Miss mm. Chris isn't watching anymore, I don't think. Miss mm. Cody? No, Miss Cody's not on. Miss Cody's taking care of a sick hubby. No, your mother-in-law is not watching. Bobby Payton? No, Miss Payton's not watching tonight either. Uh, I know Miss Lisa's watching. I know that Miss Leanne is watching. Miss Haley was watching. I don't know if she's still on. Check. I can't check. She's got to say hey if she's still here. Mm. Wait. Who is her name again? Miss Haley. Hey, Miss Haley. <laughs> <laughs> you okay. are silly. Ooh, they got this smoky looking one too. I so I'm going to use that one in a little bit. I think I said hi. You think she said hi? Yeah. Yeah? Are you sure? Yeah. Well, 
She said, yep, I'm here. Hey, my girl. Wait, you're finished that one? Yeah, Miss Haley. Yeah, I told you. She said, hey, sweet girl. <laughs> Miss Haley is awesome. Miss Haley is awesome? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Love stinky little ones. Oh, took my daughter and two grandbabies to lunch yesterday, and I was talking to Megan about the package of glitter coming in. And Wesley, first grandbaby, asked if it was from Emily. I asked, How do you know about Emily? He said, You watch her do glitter. Oh my god, I love that, Leanne. I love that. I'm telling you, I'm gonna have to do. Another mommy and me box sometime this year so that all of our littles can participate too. And mommy is now how to her cussing. Yeah. Mommy is now how to her cussing. Right, mama? What? You know how to cussings. Cussings? Cups. Oh, cups. By the scissors. Uh huh. That what I'm saying this to. Uh -uh. Oh, my boys, y'all, they sleeping next to each other. Can you sit still? Baby, Mommy, Titi, Rosie. Mm-hmm. Just that... looking at a picture of my sisters and I that I have sitting on a on my desk over here. Yeah, because Mommy have a picture of them on her My desk. sisters and I have literally gone through hell and back together. <laughs> And when I'm working, having that picture of them here with me kind of makes me feel like they're right here instead of in their respective homes. Mama? What, my angel? One time, Alden chewed up your glasses. Oh, uh, no. Is he a naughty boy? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, he do anything bad, right? He does. But, but he's just a puppy. Yeah, but... What's the keys? He's For the shed? No. Oh, the truck? Yeah. In my purse. What do you need them for? I'm talking about the car. Are you going to move the car? Oh, no. I'm going to leave it right where it's at. Wait, you leaving? No. No, Daddy's not leaving. Then what are you doing? Locking He's the locking the truck. Can I come to you, Daddy? I'm done. So I think tonight we're going to use Dayra, Sardinia, Nyx will still be thrown in there, um, I'm going to use Calypso, like I want brighter colors and I have a pink from another box that hasn't been released on the site called Persephone. 
And I think I'm going to go in with Persephone as well. Hey, get off of the puppy. Now. Please and thank you. He's getting under your chair. Yeah, probably trying to run from you. No, I think he kind of wants from daddy. Huh? I gotta find that dude's card. What card? From the guy that makes those pepper sauces. Oh, Mr. Mill from Berwick? You liked that stuff? Oh, it's good. Daddy? What? Huggy? Huggy? Okay. Oh, God, you're getting heavy. Yeah, you know, I'm just going to keep no, working. And if y'all still watching, y'all still watching. If y'all hop off, I totally understand. Hey, I want to finish that episode. But I know you got to get your work done, too. Y'all, I like that smoky one. Look at that. Smoke effect without the smoke. I'm still going to figure that out. What? How to crave y'all smoke so much. With different smoke colors. Yeah, that's something that my husband's trying to figure out. So who all is still here with me and would like to receive, because there's only four of you from the looks of it, who's still here with me and would like to receive a color from a box that they haven't received before? Comment, comment to let me know that you're here. Yeah, comment to let me know that you're here. And you guys will each receive a color from me from a box that y'all haven't received before. Hey, Heather. Who'd you steal that from, Kimer? So we got Heather, we got Lisa, we got Haley, we got Casey. Golly. So let me get this tape on and I'm going to make a note of that. You still here? You count, you count Leanne. through comments anyway. Let's see. We have Haley. I must spell it. Heather. Lisa. Brandy won something. I'm going to have to go back through and see who else. Hey, Jennifer. How you doing, boo? I'm working on my stock for the shop. I'm so excited. Hmm. 
You know, I want to go with this pack. Hi, Celia. Welcome. Uh, oh, I'm so glad. First timer. So I am using double-sided tape and washi tape and colors from our website, CDT Crafts. And so I did this cup live the other night. Went over really huge with everybody. And because I'm working on some, uh, some stock to put in a shop that's opening up on Friday locally here, I figured this one would be another really good one to do. Um, so right now, I, oh no, thank you. Right now I'm working on double-sided tape and washi tape, and then I'll be able to peel the backing off of the double-sided tape, and glitter those areas. So we only sell one size of double-sided tape on our website right now, which is the half inch. But if you want to get the kits that have the multiple sizes, you can get them from Mr. Nola's Glitter, or you can get them off of Amazon. I have ordered them from both, and it's literally the exact same thing. This one and this one. Yep, I did some Mardi Gras ones before these, Jen. What's my name? Emily. That's right. I, 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 I have an exacto knife in my hand. Don't climb up here. Don't climb up here. What I go at? You go climb behind Daddy. Mm. <laughs> Jennifer, can you believe how big Thea's gotten? So we do have a website. Um, the website is scrolling across the bottom of the screen. It's www.cdtcrafts.com. And we do currently have a sale going on where everything on the site except for our monthly boxes is 50% off. And the shop that I'm talking about is a shop that's local here to me in uh, Morgan City, Louisiana. Haley, post the uh, the code, please, for the sale. Um, this shop is local, and it's a place for local vendors to showcase their work and to be able to sell it. So I'm really excited about that because I haven't put it. it it's like a boutique shop. And I haven't put any of my stuff into something like that before, so this is really big for me. Thank you so much, Leanne. And yes, yes, we definitely need to get together. Like, all of this COVID crap is killing me. Like, I'm not... I'm not an, oh my God, let me come hug you kind of person. Like, I mean, I like to give people hugs, but I'm not going to hug everybody and a freaking mama. But, like, this is killing me.
Y'all, this is going to be super freaking cute. Welcome to the CDTC family, Celia. Make sure on top of that sale that you check out the February Craft With Me box that we have up for pre-order. You get a bunch of glitters, a tumbler, and a mold, and this is something that we do every month. And that right there definitely gives you the chance to up your glitter game because every month we release new glitters in those boxes. Awesome. Let us know if you have any questions, girl. All right, almost done taping this one up. Do the same thing that I did on the other one and end in washi tape. So I think I'm going to do these coppery polka dots again. I really like polka dots. To me, there's just something so classy about them. That one and I need another little bitty thin one so I think I'm gonna do this little doodad right here So we are about to begin our glittering process on this one. to come up. She's watching something that back there that's piqued her interest because she's not up my bum anymore. There we go. 
So that is the tape application. So now we can go in and finally start coloring. Y'all, I like these. Kudos to Walmart for having had some cute washi on the shelf. I wonder how often they change that out. Hmm. I'm going to grab out Persephone, which is one from a previous box that... I'm going to grab Calypso and I'm going to grab, come on, Athena and Athena is a much deeper red than the red that we used last night. Last night we used Johnny Appleseed and Nyx. Deira and Sardinia, and then we can just like choose and go from there. Let's see, which one do I want to start with? I think I'm going to start with Calypso. I love Calypso. She is a very vibrant pink. And this is the kind of glitter that will change appearance with whatever base you put it on. She's not chameleon. She's just shifty. Look on the stationary aisle, Casey. That's where I found mine. I had to ask somebody where it was at, but she was super helpful and told me right where it was. I think Sardinia is going to be our other color because it's brighter. Yeah. Um. Calypso is gorgeous. Yeah, I found mine in stationery. Like where they have all the uh, the planners and the journals and stuff, that's where it was at. Yeah, I was looking in the crafting area too at first because I had looked a couple of times for washi tape at Walmart. And then today I asked and it was in the stationary area. You are so welcome. All right, so we're gonna go in with Calypso.
y'all can see how bright and pretty she is. I saw Clearance Isle had some too, but it was like washy flowers that they had. It was, it was weird. I almost grabbed some, but I didn't. Yeah, it was it was weird. Like it wasn't ugly, but it was washy flowers. Washy tape flowers. Get a little bit more for this last one. Same as with the other one. Rub it into your tape. I think that's what it typically is for, honestly, is scrapbooking more than crafts. off the excess, off the tape, and I can get away with doing it like this with this one because it's the first color. through and start pulling the next set. What color should I go with next, guys? Should I go with Athena, which is red, Persephone, which is like a goldish pink, Nyx, which is our hollow black, or Sardinia, which is a coral color? The red, that's kind of what I was thinking too. So Athena has the votes. Thea, would you please quit climbing behind me? Yes, Mama. I promise. My Mama. My Danka. Yes, snuggly. I'm so snuggly? You're so snuggly. I'm gonna put this back together. Mm. Right now. Tacos. Ah, yummy. 
Tacos are yummy. Yes, they are. Tacos are life, girl. Mm. That and bacon. Mommy, can we have had tacos in the morning? No, we can't have tacos in the morning. But they want you to get them. Wait, we don't have tacos? Alright, let's open up Athena. I'm not going to be able to do that one-handed. We don't have tacos or biscuits. And I'm going to take a cup for doing it with. That's not going to work either. Shit. Where's my little spoon? Here we go. Are you going to use my spoon? Uh, I stole this spoon a long time ago. It's mine. Fair and square, kid. But it's not in your thighs. But I use it for glitter. So yes, it is. But I know this to eat. You didn't notice? Ooh, that cup is going to be fancy, Mom. That cup's going to be fancy? Yep. It's going to be nice and pretty and lovely. And I think you're going to love it. You think I'm going to love it? Yeah. I think I'm going to love it, too. What are you, who are you making that cup for? To sell. To sell? Who sell? No, I want to sell it. Sell it, but well, who are you giving that cup to? I'm not going to give it to somebody. Somebody's got to pay me for it. Oh, but you don't have money. She is such a mess, y'all. You don't have money. Why, Mom? Um, that's why I'm making it so I can sell it and get some money. So I can get the car, the mini car? Yes, so you can get the mini car. <laughs> I love Mama. I love you. Mommy, don't. Yes, Chris, I'm still rolling, girl. Still rolling. Mommy, it's everyone's crack around. Uh, me. no, that's mine, and it needs to get put back, please. Birthday. Evelyn's birthday has passed already, my love. Yeah, but we won't have a crown anymore. Y'all, this is looking pretty so far. I think it is so pretty. You think it's so pretty? Yeah, can I show them what I'm wearing? They see what you're wearing. Dora the Explorer nightgown. Yep. Dirty, you have a dirty and a spoiler. Right, Mom? Yes, ma'am. Wait, who is this spoiler? Mommy, who is this guy is? That's Boots. Boots? And who is this? I can't see. It's That's the, Dora. Dizzy. Actually, I want to uh, print my own care cards for the cups, Chris. Mommy. But, look, Miss Haley said it's a beautiful nightgown, Thea. Yeah, Miss Haley. You're dabbing that brush. Dab, dab. But no, I've, uh, I guess Mommy. that's something I could eventually start carrying. Mommy, can you see me? It's like maybe a file for care cards. Mommy, can you see me? Mommy, can you see me? Yes, I can see you. I'm a game master. Oh, you're the game master? Mm-hmm. Like, this looks like a game master. Flip this over. I think I'm going to go with Persephone next. I love being 
the game masters. Your hair is so flip. Yeah. So I think I'm going to call it a night after this one, guys. Mm -hmm. Simply because I mean, it's 1026. We've been going for My a hair. couple hours now. Your game master knows. Yeah. Oh my. My game master's nose is white. My eyes is white. My mask is white. Uh, this is only the third, Chris. I think I might wood grain one before I hop off of here, only because wood grains go super, super fast for me. Who is wood grain? Mommy, who is wood grain? Mama? Hmm? Who is wood grain? Wood grain's a type of cup, baby. But why you name the cup that? I didn't name the technique. Yeah. I just learned how to do it. You would how to do it, but well, I can say technique too. You can say technique too? Yeah. Technique is weird. How do you know technique? Because I learned it. You learned it from who? Myself. Yourself? Yes. Then, then how do you know that? Because I'm smart like that. You're smart? I'm smart too. I'm smart too, mommy. You are. You're very smart. Yep. You're like one of the smartest people that I know. I know because you love me smart. I love being smart too. Mommy? What do you? Could I find a dog? Can you do what? Those. You want that one? Mm, that one. No, this one's prettier. Mm, but this one has a heart on it. So does the other one. Wait, the hard one has a heart Yes. On it? Okay, I like the red one. The red one looks more prettier. Yeah, but he's a midget. It's not a midget. <laughs> This one is a midget. Oh my god. So this is mommy. I'm gonna need this a uh, Coco. Coco? Yeah. Because I love Coco. Coco is this a beautiful name. My huh. mommy? What, honey? Oh, Alright, I think I'm going to go with Sardinia next. And then <laughs> Nyx. I love you, Mama. I love you too, Thea. How you know I'm smart? Because you're my kid. Because I'm your kid? Yep. Oh, yeah, I'm in your kid. I got a car to do humanity. Uh huh. Family edition. Yeah, I know. Cheyenne got it for Christmas. So I want for eight years old. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, oh yes. Oh, mama. I love E O years old. E O A I B E O Y I. 
So the Republicans were winning in Georgia. Uh huh. They got the ninety percent of the votes counted, and they decided to shut it down for the night. <laughs> what does that sound like to you? About to be a whole lot of voter fraud. Yeah. But we're not going to talk about political stuff on my live. Because different strokes for different folks. Mommy, your life is awesome. Your life is awesome, Mommy. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, what? Thea acting like this? Is this an everyday thing? Yes. Well, there's your answer. Oh shit. He had an aneurysm, brain aneurysm. Oh my god. Yeah, dude. Bam, that's my... not cool. What are you doing to me, Thea? Making your hair? Making my hair? Yeah. <laughs> what? My plan for February 14th. The only truth that people in love. Alright, brush this down. Mommy, are you almost done? I'm yes, tired. I'm almost done. I'm tired too, kid. Mm, I want to go lay in bed. You want to go lay in bed? Yeah. Mommy, you still have this, right? Yes, definitely another hairstylist in the making. Yes, that is my fan, and you're going to put it down. That was my present from Rosie. Put it down. Yes, Mama. Last one, we're going to go in with Nyx, guys. And then all three of these cups that I've done so far tonight, I'm going to spray seal them tonight. And then I am going to fast set them in the morning. Your tiny house? Yeah. That's my Mardi Gras mask, silly butt. Now you you got see this, her? Where you got this mask from? Um, it's a mask that I sent out in my boxes. Well. Alright, so I'm grabbing Nyx. You're almost done? Mommy, I said, are you almost done? Almost. Mommy's working as fast as she can. Nice and pretty and lovely. My, my house, this would be beautiful. 
Yeah, well, I'm gonna be taking a bath and then. No, I mean you're missing out. I mean. Really? Really. You are so inconsiderate. Yes, I am. Take a bath, Cloud. Uh, yes. You probably can't even tell me the name of the show. Kingdom. Nicks into the tape. Mommy, he's just a good spoon. Mommy, he's just a good spoon. Mommy. Put it back. You looking for this? I love this cup too. It's really awesome. I can't wait to get it under epoxy and actually see I love it too, Mom. the final outcome. Mommy, I love your cup. You love my cup. I love you. Well, why is Tinky going on for my frozen cup? I don't know. Miss Cody's making that one. Can I make it now? Can I make it now? Miss Cody's a very busy lady. Can I make it now, Mama? Can I make it now? What are you doing? Blowing kisses? Barbie's pale kids. So this is our other washi and double sided tape cup. Ah! Final result. That is Calypso, Athena, Persephone, which is not available on the site, ah, Sardinia, back. and Nyx. Mommy, been old enough. Are you dead? Okay, I need you to move. Please and thank you. Yes. I have to get out some ink and my wood graining brush. Mm. Y'all, I'm covered. What? What you owe God and about, punk? Huh? Say what you owe God and about. Mm, maybe you glitter, maybe not. So I think I'm going to go with caramel alcohol ink for my wood grain, guys. I need to get the glitter off of my hands real quick. Or at least as best I can. Man, I played basketball for like two seconds on that VR. Girl, me. get you some sleep, Leanne. Thanks for hanging out as long as you did. What, that VR? Hey, 
Let me get my wood grain brush. When you're doing a wood grain, for those of you that haven't done it, like a rough, fluffy brush, best thing in the world. And doing a wood grain is one of the most simple processes ever. You take your ink. What, Angel? Your mouth hurts. Okay, give me a little bit, okay? This one is from Walmart. And it's just a super old rough brush. And so I'm doing a lighter color for my wood grain and I'm doing it on a white base because I am seriously considering doing a tooled leather look on this one. And so, this is the easiest way for me to make like the striations and the knots in the wood. It makes it look more realistic. And you just keep going further and further down. And it gives you okay. the knotted look. And it, a, a drop will do you to get there. And you just brush it okay. down. Plus, we need spike like a hair. You let it dissipate and brush down. Well, now they're touching each other when they sleep. Want the boys? It is extremely neat. I was so intimidated by a wood grain the very first time I did it. And the first time that I attempted one, instead of, it, like, I was more scared of the brush and ink method than the actual method itself as far as getting it done. And so I used these things called alcohol ink markers. And it was good. But it wasn't, it wasn't that good, you know? So, eventually I branched out and it was, it was a game changer. And that stiff, dry old brush... Is what gives you that wooden look, that wood grained look. It's so not complicated. So not complicated. You're literally running your bead of ink 
and brushing. She's making you fabulous, Daddy. I am so fabulous. Yeah, yeah. I made him so fabulous. You made him so fabulous? And your knots are literally as simple as that. And the more you work it, as that ink dries and gets tacky, the more of a knotted look you're going to have. You so right, Jennifer. You so right. You know I got your back. Y'all. Speaking of cups, and my friend Jennifer there, she has one of the very first cups I ever made. Like, once I really started getting hardcore into cup making, I don't even, I don't even remember if I had a turner yet or not. And she has one of my very first creations. Mommy, I'm bored. You're bored. Yeah, I'm going to bed. Mommy, could you go to bed? Very shortly. No, it's not. Well, then it looks like I'm just going to have to make you another one, huh, girl? Jennifer's cup got lost because of the kids, babe. Uh, Jennifer Lamar, the uh, cup that I had made her, got lost because of her kids. She still has her Sagittarius one, though. That's awesome! I think the Sagittarius one happened after I got my Turners. Mommy, I'm really bored. I'm really, really bored. Well, I'm almost done. Lisa, there are so many different colors of alcohol inks, and people do wood grains in so many different colors. Yes, those turners were a massive game changer. Massive. I owe that all to my hubby.
and the more that you move your brush in opposite directions, you get some really, really awesome patterning. Oh yeah, that's been happening. I don't know why people are so afraid of COVID, dude. Because it kills some people. Not everybody, but some they people. Addison, they're not that damn scared. <laughs> Darken up this area. And I'll want to redo that spot right there. And the good thing is, whenever your ink is not cured, ink cancels out ink. So if there's a spot that you're not happy with, you can always fix it. What are you doing, Thea? Ice boarding. I feel like we could use one right here, coming from the bottom. I like to let my ink set for at least 12 hours. 24 is better, but 12 is okay. And I don't like to use spray sealers on them or any kind of sealer of any kind because it can actually alter the color. And this is our wood grain. Oh, I forgot the butt. Okay. 
And then to clean your brush, you can just use rubbing alcohol and it'll get the ink right out of it. So this is our wood grain, guys. And I think that's all I'm gonna do for tonight because I do need some sleep <laughs> at some point. So I will see you guys next time. Um, thank you for hanging out. Don't forget to check out the sale and I hope everyone has a great night. Bye.